really too busy to upload our own, we search for them. Type in a name and go on the lurk for them because we live online. And what's yours becomes mine because memories are metadata that never fades away. Yeah, your Facebook photos, that shit's here to stay. But peep this, 80 years from now and you don't exist but your granddaughter does. She's curious about who great-grandmother was, but she's searching on the internet. Hoping to see a side of you she ain't seen in her just yet, and she does. Because here's a picture of great-grandma, ass out in the club. Now, it should be harder to tell because she can't see your face, and it's blurred, yeah, 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 yeah. face, but luckily, yeah. someone tagged you. And in that moment, it never nagged you that they'd sealed her fate. See, people tell baby girl that she looks like you. And hungry for heritage, she hopes that it's true. Yes, some pictures are blurry, but the message rings clearer when to find out she's got a bent over in me. I hear it, wondering out loud if this is who we were. Yeah. And what does this now mean for her? Oh, Grandma, it's sad that ladies' night specials, all the fun that you had, have robbed her of high cheekbones, bright eyes, and full lips. Family traits now reduce the thick thighs and wide hips, because when niggas pull out camera phones, you hold your ass higher than your head. Oh. Yeah! These kids are yeah. red. I'm pissed. And I said it like that so the point won't be missed. This is reckless. Humor me a moment. Keep your mental checklist. Out of all the things you want to leave for your kid, where exactly do pictures of booties fit in? Oh. Yeah. Amen. 